High school student Nick Sandman has scored a legal win after being smeared by the media. CNN has settled a $250 million defamation suit Sandman filed. It's over a confrontation with a Native American man that made the teenager look like the aggressor. Here, a look back at just some of the media coverage. Some students harassing an older Native American man, a Vietnam vet, in the midst of a special ceremony. It does look like that young man to me is taunting the Native American Vietnam vet. This face-to-face -face confrontation igniting charges of racism. The kid, Nick Sandman, he doesn't seem to be afraid, but he did make a choice, and that was to make it into a standoff. That was not a good choice. Ooh, Greg, uh, blood boiling. Cuomo does not look good there. <laughs> as good looking as he is, though, he keeps going to the gym. I want to know how much money this was settled for, and we'll never know. It drives me crazy. But this is really good news for everybody on the planet because it's a turning point. Before, there really wasn't any consequences to social media mobbery and the cancel culture, where somebody could dig up something from Brian, Brian or Juan's past and, and just destroy you. Just destroy you, not you, Shannon, because you're so <laughs> something <laughs> squeaky clean. But now, if you know that somebody can sue you, that changes your behavior. And if you don't have deep pockets, I mean, it's, it, it, your company's gotta be worried. So I, I, I think this is, could put an end to the swarm. That thing that happens when somebody finds out you said something That's stupid not. when you were 16. So I'm, I'm, I, I, I hope they, I, I hope they got something good. I hope the kid can. So one is it just a learning moment for reporters everywhere that you should be interested in the facts, not the narrative first. Mm -hmm.